Keith, disappointing because it feels like we've given that to Sheffield Wednesday. Yeah, I think uh, arguably you say we came with, uh, with a game plan. I thought we frustrated them, we kept the ball well. But uh, as a, an overall assessment, uh, at times we played good football. Uh, our decision making at times was poor and at crucial times was poor. Uh, and ultimately then when we needed quality, we didn't have it. We didn't have the quality that, that we needed um, to come away and win games, uh, especially when you're playing against the, a championship level. We, we worked some good opportunities getting into the final third, then we didn't have the, the um, didn't have the quality that was needed at the, at crucial times. And then ultimately, then um, we made some poor decisions. Uh, and again, so there's a combination of those. Yeah, we can look we can look back at and yeah, we had some good opportunities. Could have had more opportunities, but ultimately. The, the goals that we gave away, the um, poor decision making by individuals. Ultimately, that first goal, finishing wise, if, if Benno does the same at one end, it's a totally different game. They go up the other end and they get the quality of that finish. Yeah, I think that's the difference sometimes between second division football uh, and championship football. The, uh, the, the the higher you go, the more clinical teams are. Uh, you know, sometimes you play games that you you, you might only get uh, a number of opportunities, at least number of opportunities, because the opposition you play against are going to be better. So the, the more clinical you are, the, the more you progress in your career. And, and, and that's not just about Benno, that's about everybody. Um, when you get the opportunities, You've got to perform. Now, whether that's your role as a defender, a creative midfielder, midfield player, defensive midfield player, um, or as a striker, when you get the opportunities, you've got to take them. Uh, today, at times, we played some good football. Um, thought we could cause some problems. Got some into good areas at times. Then we lacked the the quality that was needed for the final third. Not ultimately, sometimes we lacked the finishing. But at the other end, some of the defending um, was equally uh, as disappointing as well. A real positive after both goals, we didn't crumble. No, we didn't because uh, we've got some good personnel and good characters in there. And ultimately, what you find is if you have um, you make poor decisions at crucial times, if you if you lack qualities at certain times, and you you don't be as clinical as what you should be, uh, you are where you are. And their first goal, a bit of a direct route, but they, they carved us open quite well. I wouldn't say carved us open. I think it was a League Two goal. Uh, punt upfield, defenders didn't deal with it. People don't stay with their runners. Poor covering positions. The, the lads end, end, ends up with a strike. So yeah, we're trying to score championship goals, and we but we, uh, we're defending against lead two types of balls and not dealing with them well enough. Um, second one, poor decision making. Uh, poor decision making on the ball. Gary will have nightmares about that. You could see after it went in that he was talking to the others and apologising. Yeah, it's, it's one of those. Um, it's not about individual mistakes uh, today. It's about collective mistakes. Collect, uh, collectively, we didn't have the, the right ingredient, as in we didn't have the qualities that were needed uh, at certain times. We didn't make the, the, the right decisions at certain times. And some, and some of our de de defending was poor. Now, uh, yeah, again, we deal with it. Uh, we don't dismantle what, what we're trying to do. And, and that t touches on what you were mentioning there, yeah. Um, I think we came, we looked creative. And I think arguably we could have gone one uh, one goal in front, possibly uh, possibly two with the skirmish in, in the box as well. Uh, then it can be a completely different environment that, uh, that you're playing in. And that's the fine lines and the fine margins when you get a second division football club coming up against a championship team away from home.